Aston Villa get the game underway with a determination to improve upon their abysmal away record. They haven't won away from home in the Premiership this season. Well, strangely, Middlesbrough have not been beaten at home. So will something give here tonight? Both sides sending out very attacking looking formations. Villa playing with three strikers. Stefan Moore on the ball here with an excellent early turn away from Frank Kedru. In attack with Dublin and Vassell. And it's left by Dublin and behind Vassell. Middlesbrough have Nemeth, who's tackled there, plus Job and Macaroni. since he arrived from Manchester United arrived on the scene at the appropriate moment then Hitzelsberger was coming back with him and may just have put him off Barnaby Nemeth good turn Shilab Nemeth first time that Peter Inkleman has been pressed into action and it was sharp play by Shilab Nemeth he turned well, shot well, it was on target. Hassan. Oh, part of his ball doesn't carry the cell! Darius Vassell marks his return to the Villa first team with a goal. Joy for the travelling fans who've not had much joy on their travels this season. Could it be the goal that breaks the Villa hoodoo and earns them a Premiership win away from Villa Park? It was a back pass from Parnaby that was intended for his goalkeeper but didn't get there. And Darius Vassell pounced with very good effect. It was a nothing ball really from Parnaby. Dublin. Hitzelsberger. Touched by Moore. Barry. Here's Delaney. Pulled across. Dublin! Well, Davis got across to shut him out. And it was a vital defensive contribution from the youngster. Because as Delaney pulled this back, Dublin all set to pull the trigger. And Davis got across to smother his shot and deflect it wide. Dangerous one played in. And somehow it stays out. Stefan Moore got across and it looked a very presentable opportunity this. Middlesbrough completely caught out by the near post flick from the corner. So he played into that area. Ronnie Johnson, I think it was, who got the knock on. Looked a gift of a chance for Stefan Moore, who somehow hooked it wide. Samuel. Dublin, good turn. Oh, God, Parnaby, this is Greening. Pedro. The answer is caught. a start to his Villa career for Joey Goodjonson and what a nightmare for Mark Schwarzer and somehow it escaped past the big Australian goalkeeper Schwarzer hangs his head in despair but Goodjonson celebrates a magnificent introduction to English football with Aston Villa goalkeeper to blame no doubt about that. Greening. Jeremy. Looking 
the job. And Macaroni! And Enkelman was caught in no man's land. And Middlesbrough are thrown a lifeline by Massimo Macaroni's first goal in open play since September. Enkelman started to come as it was played forward by Jeremy. He was never going to get anywhere near it. So by the time of Jobs' flick on, the goalkeeper was completely stranded. And that was just the invitation that Macaroni needed. Well, now we have a real contest on our hands. effort Samuel just gets the better of Stuart Parnaby slid across to Vassell and surely now Aston Villa have done it and clinched their first away win of the season in the Premiership a second for Darius Vassell the two goal lead is restored it's 4-2 Newcastle. So their next three Premiership matches against their northeast rivals. Sunderland coming up at the end of February. Liverpool away in between. So a tough month ahead really for Middlesbrough. They started the day 11 points clear of relegation, but still just looking over their shoulders a little. Dion Dublin and that wraps it up Villa cure their travel sickness it's a comfortable win in the end Dublin's header makes it 5-2 free header in the end and the fragility of the Middlesbrough defending has been there for all to see tonight and then disastrously for him to a Joey Goodyonson free kick on the Villa man's debut. Borough actually managed to recover from that with goals from Macaroni and Greening, but Gareth Barry within a couple of minutes of the restart, a second for Vassell and a crowning goal for Dion Dublin make it Villa's night. Middlesbrough's first home defeat of the season ended in jeers for them as they left the field. 
Middlesbrough 2, Aston Villa 5.